Hi, there are archaeological finds in the world that would most likely be erased from books. Often, some finds result in disputes that can lead to, for example, war. Welcome to Worldwide Top. In today's episode, we are going to talk about the most weird and controversial finds in history. Number 1. The Voynich Manuscript this is a leather-bound parchment book that originally consisted of 136 vellum pages written on both sides. When archaeologists discovered this artifact, they thought it might have been an ordinary herbarium or a textbook of medicine. However, the whole thing is complicated by the fact that the contents of the book are not quite clear. First, I will explain where the name of this manuscript came from. Wilfried Voynich was a Polish antiquarian, chemist, pharmacist and collector who in 1912 purchased the manuscript from the Jesuits from Frascati. For over 100 years, cryptologists from around the world have been trying to decipher the contents of the book, but so far, no one has succeeded. In the 1950s, the manuscript was examined by a team of cryptologists from the NSA, led by William F. Friedman. Although they failed to explain the mystery of the text, an interesting proposition was put forward. The text was probably written in one of the European languages, but was intentionally encrypted. William says it is a polyalphabetic cipher that is very difficult to decode. In 2018, two scientists, Jules Janik and Artur Stacker, using the latest technology decided that it was a work created in Mexico. They managed to recognize 60 plants from that region, as well as 12 animals. Voynich's manuscript is a very controversial book. Paranormal people and ufologists say it may be a record of recipes that were once used to treat people. Well, there is even some evidence for this theory. The manuscript is considered to be one of the most interesting, but unsolved mysteries of mankind. If you would like to support this channel, write Artifact in the comment and we will get a heart pin in return. Number 2. Sangsingdui. This is an archaeological site discovered in 1986 in China. It was in Guanghan that the remains of a lost civilization were discovered. It has been revealed that 3,000 years ago in the Bronze Age there was a very advanced civilization that mysteriously disappeared. In 1929, farmer in Sichuan province uncovered jade and stone artifacts, the meaning of which was not understood until 1986. The artifacts looked as if they had been intentionally destroyed and buried for sacrifice. Peter Keller, a geologist and president of the Bowers Museum in which the Sangsingdui artifacts are exhibited, says the objects must have been made by a very well-developed civilization. Archaeologists have put forward that the civilization most likely disappeared by an earthquake. Ufologists claim that this is irrefutable evidence of interference of extraterrestrial civilization in life on Earth. The most interesting evidence of the possible interaction of extraterrestrials with humans is the unexplained sculptures that are said to be a reflection of UFOs. What is more, extraterrestrials are also blamed for their unexplained disappearance from the Earth. Independent researchers say that these findings are very unfeasible, therefore it is rarely mentioned in the media. Number 3. Khat Shabib. It is the remains of an ancient wall in southern Jordan. It is said to have been built and used by the semi-nomadic Bedouin people, but it is considered untrue. This 150 km long wall has gained a lot of attention among archaeologists from all over the world because it is shrouded in a number of mysteries. Many still wonder who created this wall, when and for what purpose. The site was discovered in 1948 by Sir Alec Kirkbright, who was a British diplomat. The remains of about 100 so-called towers along the wall that were supposedly used to build the wall were also found. 
if anyone wanted to solve these mysteries, they would have to start with the sight and flight investigation. Number 4. Mysterious Cave Caves have been found in the mountains of central Mexico, which prove that humans inhabited North America over 30,000 years ago. Scientists say that it is at least 15,000 years earlier than people were previously thought. This discovery includes hundreds of ancient stone tools that have been subject to careful analysis and research. This is a very controversial find that may intrigue many scholars. After this discovery, other scholars took part in heated discussion, arguing that both Americas could have been inhabited by Homo sapiens about 130,000 years ago. While there is evidence to support this claim, the theory continues to be questioned. From the aforementioned period, there are so few tools found that skeptics consider them to be induced by natural geological processes. In addition to these tools, it is said that scientists found little evidence of human presence of that time. This controversial discovery could lead to changes in the literature of history. Proponents of conspiracy theories say that a lot of evidence that men inhabited areas of the Americas about 30, 130,000 years ago are swept under the rug. Number 5. Dropa Discs This is a series of at least 716 circular stone discs that are approximately 12,000 years old. There are small hieroglyphs on the surface of the round stone forms. In 1938, in a cave near Himalayan mountains close to the Chinese-Tibetan border, these unusual intriguing items of the Stone Age were found. Their name comes from the tribe that lived in the areas where the stones were found. Ufologists and pseudo-archaeologists say these artifacts are another mystery in the puzzle with regard to the association of the ancient inhabitants of the Earth with the aliens. The discovery of the dropper disks was literally accidental. In 1938, a Chinese archaeologist Chi Pu Tei led an expedition which was to perform regular archaeological research on the site of an ancient tribe, Dropa. Such researches are conducted all over the world. Scientists discovered caves where the mysterious graves have been found. In each of them, there were skeletons about 125 centimeters long. Scientists have failed to match the remains to any known human race. Internet users say that only in the Internet era we can learn about this find, because previously it was too controversial to be published in any media. Number 6. Piri Rice Map This is a map of the world made in 1513 by the Ottoman admiral and cartographer Piri Rice. This fascinating discovery was made on 9th October 1929 in Istanbul. However, let's start from the very beginning. Who was Piri Reis? An Ottoman admiral, geographer and cartographer who was known mainly for making very, very accurate maps. The composition from 1513 shows a fragment of the world that was based on a navigation system called the Wind Rose. Something completely different than the currently used a grid of graticules. People investigating the matter of this map hold that the composition is highly accurate. The Piri Rice map shows Antarctica, which was discovered in the 19th century. Experts wonder who told the 16th century Corsair what Antarctica looked like. The Piri Reis map is thought to draw on the resources of a map drawn by Christopher Columbus that was never discovered. Of course, independent scientists took part in the discussion arguing that the aliens are responsible for the Antarctica and the incredible accuracy. Number 7. Human skull with horns in the 1880s, skulls were discovered in Bradford County, Pennsylvania, with horns protruding from them. A group of American archaeologists discovered several strange skulls and bones. 
The skeletons belonged to anatomically normal males, with the exception of the bone appendages above the eyebrows. After preliminary investigation, it turned out that these are horns. Scientists estimate that the bodies were buried in 1200 AD. It is said that this was not the first time that schools with giant horns were discovered, however, in North America. In the 19th century, similar schools were found near Wellsville, New York, and in a mining village near El Pasco, Texas. It is believed that in antiquity, human horns were used as a sign of royal power.